What's up guys, in this video we're going to go ahead and go over on how Berwadis might be selling his house after his breakup and what he's currently thinking about right now. Now he recently made a video in which a lot of people thought that this was based on the relationship in which he just had with Jasmine, um, just because of how the video of the title was. Um, but in this case, it was more about his health and how he's currently doing. Um, and this all started off because he made a get ready with me TikTok video in which he ended up showing himself running. And a lot of people said that he looked unhealthy in which he later explained in his video, you know, the causes in which might be happening and other people reaching out. Um, also agreeing to how he is currently in shape. Now he's been active on social media in which he's been posting on Instagram and TikTok and he posted a TikTok video a couple days ago in which had to do with texting a girl and asking about how she is. Although throughout this whole time, you know, he's been with his mom a lot recently, whether it's going out to eat or just simply spending time. Um, in which if you guys don't remember, you know, his mom kind of posted about this on social media, basically saying like, if you mess with my son, I will come after you in which that had to kind of do towards Jasmine and how all of that ended. So yeah, Broadus is now unsure of his living situation in which he ended up talking about this publicly on Instagram live in which he was driving and kind of just going over his thoughts on what he's looking to do, you know, shortly. Now him questioning this had to do with his recent breakup in which he had with Jasmine. You know, he basically goes over on how he feels lonely and how he doesn't want to move back in with his parents. Although the house in which he has right now feels, you know, big to him in which he doesn't want to sell it at the same time because he recently just remodeled everything as of a couple months ago. Now to talk about his living situation, we all know this house in which he lived in with his family although after that he ended up moving into a apartment in which Jackie was involved during that time. Now after living in that apartment for a short period of time he moved back with his parents in which his brother as well into this house in which they all bought together. Now after going back in his parents he then moved into a content house with his cousins in which Sherman and Jessica and many others were also living there as well until that shortly ended with him being you know robbed and break-ins happening in which he's posted about this on youtube now since that ended you know he was there for a period of time you know back with his parents and which from there it led to him doing house tour videos and from there he ended up finding the house in which he liked and which was very very close and in the same community in which his parents and brother live in now from there he moved into the house in which we all know of and when he first you know recorded and showed everybody you know it was outdated and kind of vintage although he said that he wanted to change it to his liking and which which he was doing that within this past year and that's where he's been living in you know ever since the starting of 2023 but with this new home in which he got he never really lived there alone at some point you know he didn't live there at first because of the whole construction that was going on and then when he did move in you know dennis his best friend was living there in which he was in the guest house although he moved back to arizona recently and since he moved back and left he did in fact ask jasmine to move in although she respectfully denied because because she wanted to, you know, move in if they were married and had a kid instead of just being boyfriend and girlfriend. Anyways, here's a short video clip on what he's thinking based on his house. You guys know I bought a house like a year ago and I moved in, obviously. It was me, Dennis, and I mean, Jasmine pretty much lived there too. So it was us three living together. It was fun. It was like, you know, whatever. Dennis obviously had to move back less than a month later me and jasmine break up boom just like that i'm in a <laughs> in a house that i bought for multiple people now the main point of this is because he once lived with two other people jasmine and dennis um and now he's by himself in that house in which he you know did see a future with jasmine and starting family there and being together although it's just him at this point and here's him you know going over this topic because me and jasmine obviously hopefully are going to get married soon start a family so this house will be used for the right reasons but then obviously that anyways that's going to be the end of the video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe i'm going to go ahead and show you guys you know the rest of the live stream um in which he ended up doing talking about this situation i just wanted to show you guys the main two clips on what he went over but make sure you guys subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss my next upload and see you in the next one on saturday or sunday i'm gonna take like a five or six day break um 
I don't remember the last time I took a break. Kind of similar to my brother. He had to, my brother was over game boat, bro. You know, uploading so much recently and then obviously going through this breakup. I need a little break, bro. I don't wanna, um, I don't wanna be on the internet for a little while. You know, the internet could be harsh sometimes. So, you know, I'm just trying to, trying to heal myself after everything that happened recently um, off camera. But I'll be back. When I say I'm taking a break, I don't mean like two weeks, three weeks, or a month. Nah, I don't need, I don't need that much time. I just need like four or five days off the internet. And I'll be good. Uh, it's just hard to like fake a smile and, and film YouTube videos when you're in this, uh, this. Uh, I don't want to say mindset, but this little funk, you know. Going through a breakup is not fun. So, uh, it's it's. If I do post a video right now, it would just be. It would be fake energy, fake smiles, and uh, yeah, but fuck you, bro, that's life, you feel me? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I just wanted to hop on IG Live. Like I said, bro, I feel like my way of talking to my supporters and my way of connecting with you guys is through YouTube videos, and I just haven't been posting, so I feel like I haven't really been, uh, really been talking to you guys, but... Yeah, I'm also, I mean, this is sort of, I don't want to say it's a secret, but it's definitely something that I've never told anybody about. So, hey, I guess the 5,000 people in this live are the first people to, to know about this. But uh, struggling to find out what, I don't know if I should tell you guys this. I feel like people are just going to, I don't know, the internet is fucking full of weirdos. But whatever, you guys are not random people on the internet. You guys are my supporters, so I'll tell you guys. Um, you guys know I bought a house like a year ago and I moved in obviously it was me Dennis and I mean Jasmine pretty much lived there too so it was us three living together it was fun it was like you know whatever Dennis obviously had to move back less than a month later me and Jasmine break up boom just like that I'm in a <laughs> in a house that I bought for multiple people now by myself so um, I don't know what to do about the house because it's a pretty big house for one person and obviously thinking the girl that I was dating for the last year was gonna be my future wife so even when Dennis moved away I was like you know it's all good because me and Jasmine obviously hopefully are gonna get married soon start a family so this house will be used for the right reasons but then obviously that shit happened with me and my ex. So now I'm in that big ass house by myself and I don't know what to do. 